games under five dollars. This game is called Dungeon of Dark. Uh, it's a turn-based game about a dungeon with all sorts of enemies, objects, and items. You choose a hero, you explore a dungeon. It's just that easy. Uh, fight many enemies on a 3 by 3 battlefield, defeat bosses, and use items wisely. Uh, this game has... right now it's it's got three heroes, it's got three different types of dungeon floors, 16 levels, uh, more than 25 enemies, and a wide choice of items. And uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's rock and roll. Let's do this. Alright, a little walkthrough here. Good, good. This is your character, and he is in the dungeon. Yeah, yeah, well. Hello there. Makes sense. You can move by clicking on any cell floor. Alright. Kind of neat. A little, little cloudy action going, foggy action going on. Alright, pick up this item, use for later. Hold down the key to view the information. Alright, this restores three health. Cool. So, we grabbed it, put it in inventory, and if there's nothing else in this room, we'll open the door and enter the next room. Alright. Cool. Kind of hippity hoppy. I know this kind of reminds me of Darkest Dungeon a little bit. Uh, not just like the style of the graphics, not the way the graphics look. Because it's not obvious, it's not a 2D side scroller kind of, or not side scroller, but a 2D game. This is a chest. Come to it and try to open. To open the chest, you need a keys. Press the key and open it. Alright, that's what was in the chest. And it is stunning blow. Attack him enemy and stun him. Recover 10 time units. Alright. Cool. Going on. So right now I have all this stuff. What is this? Okay. No money, five hearts. Got one ability, one potion. Ready to rock and roll. I'm gonna bounce to this thing. And here's your first enemy. Now we need to defeat him. If the level of the character is less than the level of the enemy, it'll be harder to defeat him, man. Yeah? Makes sense. The level of enemy is greater than yours, the battle is inevitable. Alright, this is the amount of equipment that I can take. This is my equipment. Choose an ability, click on enemy, start fight. Alright, choose an ability, click on enemy. It is the character we control. That is, alright, you can move and interact with objects up on left right. Character's health, it falls zero, the game is over. Oof. Alright, the amount of damage that can be dealt to the enemy. Defeat the enemy to activate the event and complete the level. Alright, my first enemy looks menacing. Yay, the enemy is defeated. But it just damage just. <laughs> damage just. Alright. Use an item that would restore health, but this is uh, so spent. Alright, let's destroy him. Okay, you can see can't attack diagonally. Alright, I got a stick. Shields give armor. Alright, stick and a shield. Heck yeah. Boom. 
All right, we got a boss here. You're the last one. Complete the mission. Boss is a stronger opponent who has several eyes. Ooh. All right, so we called boss. He's stronger than ordinary opponents. Um, okay. You can use the ability to defeat the enemy. The, the ability cannot be used after for a short time. All right. All right, that character can't do anything because I stunned him. Fantastic, so I can kill him. All right, and use this door to finish the battle. Yay, tutorial. Ah, oh, three gems. Perfect. For the victory over the enemy, we'll be giving new items. I got, I got a key, I got some gems, and two potions. Cool. Or do I have to pick one? Both. Okay, got it. I gained a level. Heck yeah. Alright, for Victor or enemies to send level, the character increases level. Cool. Alright, so I still have that one damage. Got some mana maybe? Alright, so. Everybody likes the dungeon. All right, so I'll complete the tutorial. All right, well that was that was pretty cool. Let's see if we can get a little bit farther. Choose a character. Character of the character. Items of the character. Just difficulty. Select the first floor if it's already been opened, and click on the character. All right, so we have. We have more characters, but I can only use this one because it just started. So we're going to start it. Alright, the number of lives of the character. Dungeon level. Number of keys, yeah. And gold. Global map. Alright. My character options and my inventory. Okay. That's a scary looking rat. A demon rat. What was that? What the heck did I pick up? All right, all right, and consume these. Okay, what is this? Oh, it's a, it's a stone. <laughs> Makes sense. All right, I have a key. Let's get some gems, a couple potions, and what is this? Valtrins, reaches one health when taking. Oh, cool. So it pretty much saves me from getting one shot or getting killed. I mean. The enemy with whom you want to fight. Alright, yep, we already went over this. Okay, cool. Don't think. Ooh, maybe we're going to. Alright, gold which characters collected on level. Number of keys, yep. Items that can be used in the game. Hold the button to see the description. So. What the? Is that? Oh, <laughs> I thought that was an enemy for a second. That's just a piece of meat. All right, so fantastic. We got this. All right, we got this. And we are just gonna. Damn, I died. <laughs> All right, well, that was uh, I. I died. That was not what I wanted to do, but that's. Still pretty fun. I mean, it's. I'm assuming that it's a it's a, it's a randomized dungeon every time. Hopefully, it's not the same thing. Uh, I didn't read anything about it being random, but I'm assuming it is a quote unquote difficult game. Not that me dying is, you know, make making it difficult, or because it's difficult. Uh, just uh, pay attention. All right, so. Uh, yeah, uh, it's a pretty fun game right now. It is a dollar ninety nine on Steam. Uh, if you want to wait until it goes on sale, pop it on your wish list. 
If not, I, I, I think it's worth two bucks. It's a pretty fun game so far, and you know, if only scratch the surface, and there's other characters to play. And like, I'm fairly certain you can get your your don dollar ninety nine out of it. Now, is this released this year? So, uh, hopefully, they. It's an early access game too, so I'm assuming that it uh, it'll get more stuff. Uh, they did just add uh, last month that that uh, character, the last character, the little. I don't know. It's just. I don't know what what they are, but uh, it was the last character that that we saw the one for 400, for 400 coins, uh, but. I'm gonna play it and I'm gonna find out because I think this game is pretty fun. If you liked what you saw, hit that little like button down below. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, leave a comment, let me know what you think of this uh, game. Let me know what you think of the series. Uh, let me know what you think I can improve about this stuff. Uh, I have a lot of fun playing these games and I hope to continue them. Uh, right now, the schedule is going to be now that you know things are a little bit less chaotic with the. Oh my God! Uh, who the stuff that's hell going on in, in the uh, world today? Uh, I plan on trying to make these uh, an every Saturday kind of thing. I kind of slacked off in the humble bundle, uh, but I'll I hope to get those going again in August. We'll see. I'm going back to school in the fall, so I never know what's going on. Uh, life is interesting, but for now, I'm gonna try to make it every Saturday. A, a Steam game under five dollars to bring you uh, fun games under five dollars. So yeah, if you like what you saw, let me know. And thank you all for watching. Have a nice day.